As Michael Zare and his group's religious life changed, so did their lives as farmers. By the 1850s, the group had slowly been able to clear large tracts of acreage, up to 50 acres per farm. While their neighbors in Jefferson County were the state leaders in producing profitable crops such as spring wheat and barley, the poor soil in Lewis County left the Amish Mennonites to turn their focus from cash crops to the raising of livestock. They mainly raised sheep, swine, chickens, and cows. At first, most farms only had one or two cows for personal use. But by the 1850s, herds had increased to four or five per farm. It became popular to build two-story barns with the cows in the lower level slightly below grade and grain in the upper level above grade so that both levels were accessible by foot. As the herds grew, the group discovered that the selling of dairy products was relatively profitable. The cheese-making skills the families had learned in Europe were especially sought after. By the end of the 1800s, the first cheese factories appeared in the region, and within the next several years, cheese factories spanned the entire Lewis County area.